In this video presentation, we're going to look at two-way switching of a lighting point when it's wired in conduit. So we've got this switch here and this switch here being two-way switching, controlling this lighting point here. Remembering, as we're wiring in singles, we have the greater flexibility of taking the conductor exactly where we need it to go each time. And also that our line, switching line and strappers are all brown. We haven't got any issues with oversleeving a different colour conductor. We will pull them in using brown conductors for the live family. We've got blue for neutral and green and yellow for CPC. And in this presentation, I'll look at how we've wired up, connected our conductors in order to achieve two-way switching in a conduit system. So let's start off with the neutral then. The blue neutral is connected within the neutral termination within the consumer's unit in this case. So we come out from the consumer's unit, we know exactly where it's got to go from the previous presentation. It's going to go directly to the bayonet cap lamp holder and as always as it is a bayonet cap lamp holder it doesn't matter if it goes on the left or the right hand side but we've connected our neutral into the lamp holder itself so straight from the consumer unit the neutral goes straight to the lamp holder itself the root of the CPC again starts in the consumer's unit in the earth terminal and we tried to limit the number of CPCs in the actual straight skirted back lamp holder so our CPC in this case went from our consumer's unit down to the first switch where we've connected it in a maintenance free connector and then from this switch rather than going directly to the actual lighting point we took it down to the switch again connected it into a maintenance free connector and then back to the straight skirted baton lamp holder and connect it in the back termination the reason we did that we were trying to reduce the number of conductors actually at the lamp holders to make it easier to terminate so our line conductor starts at the top of the 6 amp circuit breaker our permanent line comes down into the first switch and is terminated into the common termination. Doesn't matter whether that's at the top or the bottom, as long as it goes into the common termination. We then have two brown strappers coming out of L1 and L2, round to the other switch, where they're equally connected into L1 and L2, but it won't matter if they're the opposite way round. So if it was L2 here and L1 this end, it doesn't matter as long as they go in L1 and L2. And then from the common, we go up to the lighting point as our switching line conductor. So therefore, we've got a neutral circuit protective conductor and a switching line at our baton lamp holder. So let's just recap that again. Line comes out the top of the breaker into common. Two strappers come across from L1 and L2 to the other switch where they're connecting in L1 and L2. And from common, we go up to the lighting point, putting a switching line on it. So there we have it. That is our two-way switching method employed when wiring in conduit for a lighting circuit. Hope this video has been some help.